Hi, my name is Robin Wong. I'm a photographer based in Kuala Lumpur, Malaysia. In this video, I want to do a follow-up on my slow autofocus claim on this OM system or M1 camera, which I did in my previous video. Let's do this! In my previous video, I talk about some of the issues that I've had with this OM system or M1 camera. I'll put the link to the video up here. Please check it out if you have not done so. I've talked about how this OM1 has slower autofocus in comparison to the predecessors EM1 Mark III and even the EM5 Mark III. I was referring specifically to single autofocus mode with the smallest focus targeting area. I have received a lot of comments on that previous video, some asking several questions, some seeking clarifications, and I intend to address some of them in this particular video. One of the popular questions that I get asked was, which firmware was used on this OM1 camera when I tested the autofocus? Well, it was the latest firmware version 1.4. In my previous tips and tricks videos, I've mentioned several times that you must update your camera to the latest firmware version. I see no reason why I don't follow my own advice. The second comment that I get was, well Robin, you were shooting a plain brick wall. That doesn't represent anything. It doesn't show the capabilities of the camera. Well, there's no contrast on the wall. Of course, the autofocus will fail. Here is the thing. If the camera cannot even handle a non-moving wall, what confidence do I have on this camera to do autofocus in real life scenarios where there's critical moments? Not only that, bear in mind that I was testing this camera in comparison to the previous EM5 Mark III. If EM5 Mark III can handle the wall with zero issues whatsoever, I see no reason why this OM1 cannot do the same. My complaint is not so much of why this OM1's autofocus is slow, my complaint is that it is slower and less reliable than the previous cameras. Anyways, here is a set of examples that I've shot, just shot, to show you that not only the brick wall, but in some other situations, the autofocus on this OM1 is indeed slower. Then some people commented, but there are like a thousand autofocus points across the frame using a single autofocus point, the smallest one. It's not fair because it's not big enough to pick up enough contrast to focus effectively. Why don't you use a larger focusing point like the small target point where it has a cluster of single autofocus points to improve the focusing efficiency? Well, here is a test to show you that it doesn't make any difference. Like what I've mentioned in my previous video, I've used this OM1 camera for a dozen or so professional shoots. And I've got to say, based on my shooting experience, this single autofocus performance was a letdown. I did miss some critical moments, I did miss some shots, and this is worrying because when I was shooting with the EM1 Mark III, EM1 Mark II, I never had such issues. I had more confidence using the older cameras. And then some people are saying, oh Robin, now that you're not an ambassador, you are what, sour grapes or wow, you're saying things differently, you're bashing the camera and the brand. I have 
always been truthful in my reviews, even when I was an Olympus visionary. If you look back at my reviews, which they were all still on this channel, I've mentioned I was disappointed with the same image sensor with no image quality improvement in the EM1 Mark III or the EM5 Mark III and the EM1 X as well, even before this channel existed. I've also mentioned my disappointment on the single touch screen, single touch operation on the LCD screen since many, 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 many years years ago, even before there was an OM Digital Solutions. I've said all this, I've complained about the cameras, things that I don't like about the cameras. I've always been honest and critical every time I do a review, whether I'm a visionary ambassador or not. Nothing changed, I've always stayed the same and I'm still doing the same thing. I noticed there's something wrong with the camera, I noticed that the autofocus is slower. Hey, I'm just saying what I found out on this channel. I'm not here to confirm your bias. I'm not here to justify your purchase on the camera. If I say something wrong, I will say it. And I'm saying this truthfully as a professional photographer, having used this OM1 for my professional shoots. But hey, you don't have to agree with me. You can pick and choose whatever you want to believe in. That's none of my business. But whatever I say, I still stay true to them. If you found my sharing beneficial, please consider buying me a cup of coffee or you can contribute directly to my PayPal. Links in the description below on how you can do that. Any small contribution will definitely help me to continue making honest comments and really dig out some of the issues on any cameras out there and I will share and publish them on this channel. Until the next one, please go out and take more photographs. Bye-bye. Thank you.